Thanks for joining us once again here on Tissue World Television. With us now, Paul Bichot from Canfor Pulp in Canada, who's the uh, manager of Origination Innovation. Optimization Optimization. And there we go, got it. And you've just presented an amazing paper, sir, on softwood, hardwood pulp. You did a pilot study, I believe. Yes, uh, we did. Can you tell us a little bit about that and give us the details on it? Sure. Um, we sell a significant portion of uh, our, the pulp that we produce on an annual basis to tissue manufacturers. And they use our pulp and blend with hardwood pulps to make quality, high quality premium tissue products. Yes. And one of the main questions that they have is, what's the best way to refine that tissue, or that, that furnish? Should it be together, blend the softwood hardwood together and then co-refine them? Or should it be uh, refining the uh, softwood on an optima uh, uh, separately and then blending it with the unrefined hardwood? And there are pros and cons to both. And uh, the, st the uh, paper that I gave just described some of the benefits. When you co-refine, you get higher strength, but less bulk and softness. And when you refine the softwood separately, there is improved drainage, better productivity, better drying, but you also get a higher bulk, higher softness, but a slightly lower strength. Excellent. Now you went to the Voigt Innovation Center in so Brazil, I, yes. I understand. Why did you choose Brazil for the study? Uh, Voigt is uh, one of the leading manufacturers of uh, tissue machines. And they make, uh, their, their, they manufacture the Atmos, their, their, uh, uh, they make the Atmos machines. Uh, they're very highly regarded. And they have this uh, uh, innovation center in Sao Paulo, Brazil, where they manufacture the machines. And what we, what we have is an arrangement with them where we provide them with pulp for some of their studies. And in return, we get some time on their machine to, uh, to basically do work like this. Brilliant. And the audience response from your presentation, sir? Uh, very positive. Uh, uh, I will be going back up and uh, having coffee with some of the audience members and seeing what sort of questions they, uh, they have for me, but uh, overall it was very good. Brilliant. And no, you're no stranger to tissue world as well? Uh, no, I've been coming here for since 2015. So the show I'm, keeps evolving, doesn't it? It just keeps getting bigger and better. Uh, it does. Uh, the industry becomes, uh, puts constraints on their suppliers and, and they're always striving to improve, which is one of the exciting things about the industry. Um, they're always, they always want to do more with less. They want to make a better product. They're really focused on the, uh, uh, on the consumer. And as suppliers of that industry, we have to uh, meet their expectations. Brilliant. Well, we're delighted that you presented a wonderful technical paper this year at Tissue World Miami. Thank you very much indeed for being here. Thank you very much for And thanks for joining us in the studio. Thanks very much, Michael.